Welcome to MB Trading's online tutorial series. This presentation covers features related to Forex trading with MB Trading. Before we get started, please take a few minutes to read through our legal disclosures on this slide. This presentation is a general overview of using the charts within MetaTrader 4 software. To access charts on MetaTrader 4, you will simply click on File, New Chart. When you click on this option, it will bring up a list of current charts as well as all of the different foreign currency pairs we have available. For example, if we were to choose the EURUSD, it would populate a new EURUSD chart. Once you have populated the chart, you want to click on View, Toolbars, and make sure you have your Charts Bar and your Line Studies populated. Your Charts Bar allows you to access a Bar Chart, Candlestick Chart, or a Line Chart. When you first click on Candlestick Chart, it will look like a Bar Chart. However, you must then zoom in on the chart and you will see your candlesticks populate. You can zoom out to adjust the size of the chart. The next button is your auto scroll, your chart shift, a drop down list of all of the indicators available with MetaTrader 4, a drop down list of the different periods available with MetaTrader 4 and a drop-down list that allows you to save and load different chart templates. If you then right-click on the chart and select Properties, you can set up the different color schemes available with the MB Trading MetaTrader 4 charts. For example, you can change your background colors, you can change your bar up, your bar down colors, as well as any other colors available on the chart that can be changed. When you have made any of these selections, you will simply click on OK and the chart will change to fit the parameters that you set up. To view multiple charts on your MetaTrader 4 platform, you will click on Window, Tile Horizontally, or Window, Tile Vertically, and it will arrange all of the charts that you have available down at the bottom of the screen. If you want to view one specifically, maximize it and the chart will populate. If you want to remove a chart, simply right click and select on close and that will delete the chart from your screen. To set up line drawings on your chart, again you want to make sure that you selected view, toolbars, line studies. This will bring up your line drawing toolbar giving the most popular line studies that are available. For example, you can set up a horizontal line by clicking on the icon and drawing the line on the chart. Once you have drawn the line on the chart to set up the preferences, you simply right click on the chart, select the objects list, check off the object that you have on the chart, in this case it's a horizontal line, and click on edit. This brings you to the editing tool where you can set up the common features, including the colors and line thickness, the parameters, and your visualization. To delete a line off a chart, simply click on it and select delete, and the line is now deleted off of the chart. You can also use your crosshairs to give you information about the pricing on a specific candle. For example, if we were to zoom in on a candle and move our crosshairs to the beginning of it, it would tell us the time and the price that that candle was at at the particular moment. You also have your equidistant channel and your Fibonacci retracement, your text box, text label, and different arrows available from the Line Studies toolbar. You can access more lines by clicking on Insert, Lines, 
channels, GAN, Fibonacci, shapes, and arrows. To insert indicators onto your chart, you can access these from several different locations. First, you can click on Insert Indicators, and this will give you all of the different indicators we have available. You can also access your indicator dropdown from your Charts toolbar, and you can access your indicators and your custom indicators from your Navigator window. For example, if you wanted to load on a custom indicator, you would expand out the custom indicators, select the indicator, drag and drop it onto the chart, and it would first prompt you to set up your different parameters. Once you have set all of these up, you would click on OK, and the indicator would now populate onto the chart. If you wanted to set up an additional indicator, you could select Tools, you could select Insert, Indicators, for example, Bollinger Bands, set up your parameters and click on OK. This allows you to manage multiple indicators on your MetaTrader 4 charts. To edit or remove indicators on the chart, simply right click, select the indicators list, and you can select the different indicator that you want to remove and set up on your chart. If you want to save a chart template for future use, simply right click, select template, save template, and then type in the name of the template. Click on save and your new template will be available in your drop-down list. You can switch between templates easily by selecting them from the drop-down list and switching between different templates on MetaTrader 4. In our next section, we will review order entry with MetaTrader 4.